All right, here we go. We're on day two now of our reading support group that where I am going to be doing the video here and you're going to be participating on the video and then I'll pull you into a breakout room to do an assessment. So here we go. We will be producing rhyming words. I will say a word family, a rhyme, and a word that rhymes with it. Can you tell me more words that rhyme? Rhyming words have the same middle and final sounds. So let's rhyme with Eed, for example, need would be an example that rhymes with Eed. Think of some other words that have that rhyme with Eed. Okay, maybe you thought of read or seed or speed. Those would all be Eed words. Let's move on. I will say a word. You will repeat the word and isolate the first sound you hear. The first sound may be a consonant. It might be a digraph. It might be a vowel sound. And you will say that initial first sound that you hear. So let's start with the word computer. Computer, what's the first sound? All right, did you say, good job. All right, next one. Galloping, what's the first sound? G, is that what you said? All right, next one, they, they. First sound. Mm, that one's a little tricky. Mm, in they. What about shaking? would be the first sound. Okay, we're gonna move on. When we read words, we say the sounds and blend them together. I will say three sounds and you will blend the sounds into a word. O, E, P. What is the word? Leap. Good, next one. At. What is the word? Hat. I. Mm. What is the word? Sign. B. A. Z. What is the word? Buzz. Okay, next up. I will say a word, you'll repeat the word and isolate the last sound you hear and punch up for that last sound. Today, you'll be isolating the first sound of a consonant blend, okay? So here we go. The word is self. What is the last sound in self? Did you say, if so, you are correct. What about slant, the last sound? would be the last sound. What about bend? D would be the last sound. Next step, we will write and spell words. We listen for each sound and match the sounds to the letters. We will segment or separate words into the sounds we hear. I will say a word, you will repeat the word and segment the, the word into sound. And also count the sounds that you hear by holding up your fingers to show how many sounds. So here's our first one. We have nice, nice. Nice would be mm, I, s. All right, next one, seat. Seat would be eat seat. Next one. Fame. Good. 
fame would be a mm. all right let's go to the next one i will say a word or word part and you will repeat it i will add a sound at the beginning and you will say the new word so here we go say end add b at the beginning the new word is Bend. Say ale. Add mmm at the beginning. The new word is male. Say ache. Add s at the beginning. The new word is sake. All right. Next step, I will say a word and you'll repeat it. I will delete or take away a sound at the beginning and you will say what is left. So say name without the n. Mm. What is left? Aim. Say dome without the d. What is left? You would say ohm. Say land without the o. What is left? And. Say keep without the k. What is left? Eep. All right. We are going to review our letter name and sound. All right, so here we go. We're gonna act like little turtles that are kind of swimming around, okay? So T, T, turtle, and then act like you're a little turtle swimming around. T, T, turtle. T, T, turtle. Okay, next up, we're going to write the letter T. Big line down, little line across. We say T. Do that three times. When you are all done with that, I would like you to go to the story that you practiced yesterday and again, read that with an adult. Again, if you hear your name, um, I will be bringing you into a breakout room where you will then practice some words with me, okay? All right, thanks for your hard work, kiddos. Bye.